the top of the water filter is a hemisphere and the bottom is the cylinder with dimensions shown below which answer choice below is the closest to volume okay here's here's your geometry term okay volume of the water filter okay here's another very important instructions leave the answer in terms of pi all right so let's go get our formula go ahead and write down all of it and then take out the pi so we want to go to volume of a cylinder and a sphere there they are right there now we want the cylinder pi r squared h and we want the sphere four thirds pi r to the third pi r squared pi r squared h plus four thirds pi r to the third all right now the cylinder is full cylinder it's not cut in half the sphere the hemisphere formula for that is for the sphere this is a half a sphere hemisphere so you can either because this is a fraction um you can either take this whole thing divide by two or let's multiply by all this gets multiplied right pi times r squared times h plus four thirds times pi times r to the third times and you can do you can turn that point that one half or dividing by two into 0.5 that'll take care of the hemisphere now we need the radius we look over here there's nothing in the reading about radius we have to go to the diagram and we see that there's a line segment here from the cent uh, from the point on the circle of the cylinder okay all the way across over here uh, that is 12 at the diameter okay got to find the radius okay let's make our note up here that the radius is half of 12 okay that's going to equal six so my height is 13 and now let's let's go ahead now and look one more time we have pi was there anything about pi i need to recall yes we will leave the answer in terms of pi take out the pi now and replace the we can uh, replace the radius at the same time so r squared here would be six squared times 13 plus four thirds times six to the third times 0.5 that's it finish this problem